Nothing built can last forever, and every legend, no matter how great, fades with time. With each passing year, more and more details are lost, until all that remains are myths, half-truths. To put it simply, lies. And yet, in all the known universe, between here and the Far Lands, the legend of the Order of the Stone endures on a bridge. As self-evident fact. Indeed, it is only a troubled land that has need for heroes. And ours was fortunate to have, so long ago, four heroes such as these. Gabriel, the warrior, before whose sword all combatants would tremble. Eligard, the redstone engineer, whose machines would spark an era of invention. Magnus the rogue, who would channel his destructive creativity for the benefit of all. And Zorin, the architect, builder of worlds, and leader of the Order of the Stone. These four friends together would give so much to gain their rightful place as four heroes. Their greatest quest would take them on a dangerous journey to fight a mysterious creature known as the Ender Dragon. In the end, the Order of the Stone emerged victorious and the dragon was defeated. Their story complete, they slipped away into the pages of legend. But when one story ends, another one begins. Would you rather fight a hundred chicken-sized zombies or ten zombie-sized chickens? Just to be clear, you wouldn't have any weapons or armor. Huh? Huh? What? It's just a dumb question. Forget it. So, I've got a daylight sensor on the roof, mm -hmm. and if I did this right, these lamps should turn on once it gets dark. Mm -hmm. I didn't want to just leave Reuben here with nothing while we're at the building competition. He's coming with us? Really? <laughs> what kind of question is that? Of course he is. Okay, I'm not saying he shouldn't come. I'm not. But don't you think it's a little weird that you take him with you everywhere you go? He kind of makes us look like... I don't know. Amateurs. All right, I was just making a point. I didn't mean anything by it. I'm glad he's coming. I just don't want to give people one more reason to call us losers. I'm getting tired of it. I'm tired of being a laughing stock. Who cares what other people think? I know. I'm just. It wears you down. You say you're not a loser, Olivia. So win. Okay. Fine. Do you hear that? Oh, no. Oh, <laughs> <laughs> oh, man. You guys totally freaked out. That was uh... Axel, what's the matter with you? Great. Now I'm going to smell like a pig in Endercon. I thought we were buddies. That wasn't funny, Axel. I brought you good times and now I'm being punished for you it? You scared us half to death. Did you bring the fireworks? Of course I did. I even brought something for the little guy. Nice. You brought Reuben a disguise? Um, we're going to a convention. Somebody's got to wear a costume. As long as Reuben is happy, I'm happy. Happy? Well, zippity-doo-dah. Okay, relax, it's fine. You definitely brought the fireworks, right? Yes, I'm ready. Waiting on you guys. Hurry up and grab your stuff. We'll meet you downstairs, okay? Okay. Gabriel the Warrior. You think we'll ever get that famous? It's not impossible. Maybe I'll get famous for my sweet poster collection.
one of these days, we're gonna win the Endercon building competition. And when we do, people will look at us and say, hey, there goes Jesse and Ruben, winners of the Endercon building competition. I got this stand as a gift, but I don't have any armor to put on it. Maybe someday. Give me a dragon war, Reuben. <laughs> That'll do, Reuben. That'll do. Not too shabby. Shears! Definitely taking these. Never know when I might need to shear some sheep. That's everything. Let's roll. Yeah, dude. Roll. Let's go. I heard a pretty juicy rumor about the building competition, but you guys have to promise not to say anything. Okay. Also, it's in two parts. Each part more exciting than the last. Spit it out, Axel. Part one. The special guest at this year's Entercon is none other than Gabriel the warrior him freaking self. Whoa! What's part two? Part two, according to my sources, the winner of the building competition is going to get to meet him. It doesn't mean anything if we lose. But if we win, oh man, this would make up for all the losing. Meeting Gabriel would be a dream and an honor. Totally. He's awesome. It would be amazing to meet him. Reuben better be careful in that costume. The last time Gabriel saw a dragon, it didn't end well. So, does this source of yours make posters for a living? Huh? Yeah, my, uh, source, uh, doesn't exist. You guys are my only friends. Guys, let's stay focused. We have a competition to win. We never win. And this year we've got Reuben with us. We basically have no chance. Faith, Olivia. What? A little slice, a sliver, a portion, just a little faith. That's all we need. Also, I'm hungry. To win. To win. No, no, I'm with that. Wait a minute. Wait a minute. We're thinking about this all wrong. The point of the building competition isn't just to build something. You have to do something to get noticed by the judges. Okay then, so how do we do this? We don't just build something functional. We build something fun. After we finish the fireworks machine like we planned, then we build something cool on top of it. You might be onto something. If we want to get a reaction out of the judges, you build something scary. So I say we build a creeper. Wouldn't an Enderman be better? I'm more scared of Endermen than creepers. They both have their moments, both pretty scary. Then again, you scared the crap out of us with a creeper today. All right. Let's build the creeper. You're going with Axel's idea? What's wrong with my idea? Nothing. It could be totally cool. It is cool. Yeah. I think this is the first time we've decided on something before getting to the competition. Think we've got everything we need? It wouldn't hurt to grab a little more. Let's get to grabbing then. We're so prepared. We can't lose. Cannot. Bring it in. <laughs> Dare to prepare on three. Nope. Preparing is daring. Nope, that's the same thing. Forget it. Team on three. One, two, three, team! Prepare.
We know what we're building. We've got all the stuff for it. We are so ready. This year, it's going to be different. I'm not just ready to build. I'm ready to win. Nice pig, losers. Oh, oh great. There's Lucas and the Ocelots. The rivalry continues. Man, they've got matching leather jackets and everything. So cool. Well, well, well. If it isn't the order of the losers. <laughs> Great. <laughs> the fail squad's here. Lucas, get a load of these losers. Let's go, guys. Name, please. Axel. And uh, how do you do? No, your team name. Team name? We are not ready for this. So much for losing anonymously. We're the Dead Enders. Whoa, sounds like a name for pirates. It's cool. Okay, Dead Enders, you guys are in booth five. Ah, ah, ah. Hmm. Nope. Is that a freaking beacon? They have a freaking beacon? Freaking beacon? That's stained glass. They aren't just building a beacon. They're building a rainbow beacon. We're gonna lose. Close your mouth, Axel. We should probably stop staring at them. Ha ha ha! Look, it's the Order of the Losers again. <laughs> Good one, Gil. We're just looking. There'll be plenty of time for you all to look at it after it wins and gets shown at Endercon. You're being unpleasant. Maybe not all of you. Endercon doesn't allow outside food or drink. <laughs> I'm talking about your pig. Shut up. What's that? Jesse said, shut up. Do you need to hear it again? I don't know. Maybe. Stop wasting your time, Aiden. We've got work to do. You're lucky I'm busy. Hey, Josie. Guys? Hey, Petra. How's the build going? Only time will tell, but we're optimistic. Hey, Petra. I forgot to thank you for that nether star. Hey, Lucas. Not a problem. You help these tools? For the right price, I'll help anyone. If you need anything, you know where to find me. None of us know where to find you. Exactly. No hard feelings, guys. If you're cool with Petra, you're cool with us. So why don't we just forget about all this and, you know, make this about how cool our builds are. May the best team win. Careful what you wish for. We'll see about that. Ladies and gentlemen, welcome to the Endercon Building Competition. The winners of this year's competition will have their build featured at Endercon. The winners will also meet in person, Gabriel the Warrior! Ocelots! 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 Whoa, handshake? We don't have a handshake. <clears throat> we'll just make one up. We'll call it the, uh... The Redstone Wrap. <sighs> and just like that, I'm nervous again. Don't talk like that. We can do this. Just stick to the plan, and everything will be fine. This year, the Dead Enders can't lose. Let's do it. Building starts now. Oh no! A fireworks dispenser? 
I'm so scared. <laughs> you worry about your build, and we'll worry about ours. And now, the moment of truth. Here goes nothing. Oh man, that looks so cool. We'll win this for sure. The creeper was definitely the right way to go. Guys, people are looking at us. Good build, man. What? No way. It's just a bunch of dyed wool! Whoops. Oh no! Ruben's on fire! Ruben, no! Come back! It was Aiden, that punk. The lava's getting closer. They're gonna ruin the build. Ruben's going to get lost. We've got to do something. But our build is about to go up in flames. You guys stay and save the build. On it. We've got a cover, Jesse. Be careful. We'll meet up with you at Endercon. Ruben, where are you? Just. Give me an oink if you can hear me! He must have run by here. Doesn't look like this fire will spread. I bet Reuben started this. Reuben? Are you in there? Stupid pigs. Reuben? No, not you guys. Pigs? All pigs but Reuben. Shut up!
open. to see you. Let's get out of the open. I want to show you something. Not that this isn't a really cool, dimly lit tunnel, but how far away is this thing you want to show me? Careful, Jesse. You don't want to get a reputation as a wimp. This isn't my first time in a cave, Petra. Yeah, but have you ever seen a wither skull? Whoa! Fresh from the nether. You're the first person I've showed it to. So, you better appreciate this. You risked your life for that dusty old skull? No, oh, I risk my life for the thing I'm gonna exchange for that dusty old skull. There's this guy I'm meeting up with at Endercon. He's gonna trade me a diamond for it. Being the resident go-getter pays off every once in a while. Literally. Is a wither skull worth that much? <laughs> Are you kidding? For all the trouble I had to go to get it, I should be asking for much more. Wow. Wow what? In a single day, you went to the nether You killed a wither skeleton. I mean, I did build a super cool statue, but still. 
It's pretty sweet being you, huh? You know, you could come with me. I mean, if you're too nervous, I totally get it. But I wouldn't mind a little backup. You want me to come with you? Consider it my charitable act for the day. I'll consider it whatever you want me to consider it. So long as I get to come. You just keep a crafting table down here? Comes in handy. Since that wooden sword of yours got busted... You're giving me a new one? Even better, you can make your own. One stick plus two stones equals one sword. Just grab what you need. Oh, okay. Thanks. Hey, is all this stuff yours? No, we're just stealing from whoever was dumb enough to leave us here. Of course it's mine. Just making sure. Here we go. Jackpot. Just place the pieces on the table. Come on, Jesse. We don't have all night. Yeah? See? Isn't it better when you make it yourself? Check it out. Endercon's all lit up. I can't believe it. We won! Axel was right. Everyone loves a creeper. Good for you, Jesse. It's about time we beat Lucas and his gang of jerks. What kind of stupid name is the Ocelots, anyway? You know, Lucas may be kind of arrogant, but he has come through for me in tricky situations. You might want to get to know him. Just in case. He's good at building, that's for sure. It's always useful to have a guy like that around. No matter what you might think of him personally. Hey, I'll be a gracious winner. But that's it. He'll get one handshake, and one good build, good build. Nothing more, nothing less. Just think about it. Come on, let's hurry. Remember what Andercon was like before it was cool? Remember what we were like before we were cool? Some of us will never be cool. Ha ha. <laughs> Creepers. This doesn't look good. Well, there's only one way off this bridge. Whatever we do, we do it together. All right, let's jump. into the water. You don't land on top of it. Pull yourself together and follow me. So, when we're making the deal, I need you to let me do the talking. Okay? I just don't want anything to screw this up. Or... anyone. Sure. I'll let you handle it. And if you want to be really useful, try to look intimidating. Like this? 
sure. I'm less scared of you than scared for you. Jesse. And Petra? Hey, you all know Petra, my new super close friend. We're super close now. We ran into each other while I was looking for Reuben. Poor Reuben, what happened to his eye? We had a little run in with some zombies. They whacked him good, but Reuben held his own. What were you doing in the woods, Petra? Nothing, just drawn by the sound of Jessie's high-pitched screams. I would have been spider bait if she hadn't found me. Sorry we didn't come with you, Jessie. But hey, we won. Looks like abandoning friends in their time of need paid off yet again. If I didn't know any better, I'd think that creeper was really gonna explode. We did okay, didn't we? I still wish I'd gotten that part in the back to look better. I could have fit more fireworks in there, somewhere. We deserve a victory party. Who's in? I like all kinds of parties, but especially ones where I get to celebrate winning. About time I'll be the guest of honor at something. Hey, Jesse, it's time to go see about that thing. Oh, right. The thing. Subtle. Yeah? As a punch to the face. Axel and I were going to head into Endercon anyway. See you in there? I heard somebody saying there's free cake by the map booth. Hurry. We're supposed to meet in the alley over there. Dark. Dark. Very dark in here. That's weird. He said the dark, creepy alley close to the gates, but he's not here. Maybe he's late. Are you sure this is the dark, creepy alley he meant? Hmm. I was. Okay, new plan. You stay here, just in case this is the spot he meant, and I'll look around. I guess I could have heard him wrong. Then again, I've never gotten a meetup spot wrong before. Something about this feels off to me. All of my secret deals feel off. That's why I usually keep them a secret. I'll be back before you know it. If he shows up while I'm gone, just stall for me. <coughs> ah! And just who are you? I'm waiting. Answer me! You know, you really shouldn't creep up on people like that. It's... Creepy. Don't test me. I'm supposed to meet with Petra, not whatever you're supposed to be. Give me one good reason why I shouldn't walk out of here right now. Well? I'm a very busy man. I'm ready to do this deal if you are. My deal is with Petra. She'll be here. But we can get started without her. Do you have the skull? Uh, well... You do or you don't? Take a breath, would you? I'll show you the skull when I'm good and ready. Unacceptable. I'm not wasting any more time with you. Ivor! Not a moment too soon. Your partner here almost soured the deal. Ah, oh, well, that's not good. I left my friend Jesse here while I went looking for you. I've got what you ask for. If you have what you promised us. You didn't say anything about an us when we first met? And I don't like surprises. If these are the sorts of people you associate with, perhaps we should call the whole thing off. My friend is fine, right, Jesse? There's no problem here. Let's not be too hasty, okay? This is just a little misunderstanding. I'm cool if he's cool. It's settled then. You're both cool. Proceed then. I'll take that diamond now. Take it. You've earned it. Uh, this isn't a diamond. No, it's lapis. Of all the dirty, underhanded tricks to pull. I can't believe that guy got one over on me. Let's go after him! I'm either getting that diamond, or I'm getting my skull back. Or you'll make him pay, right? Right? Come on. Do you see him anywhere? We lost him. Then we'll just have to find him again. Go.
there he is! Gabriel! Gabriel! Step aside, I have please. just one question. Hold all your questions until after the keynote. The keynote sold out! Hold all your questions anyway. You guys big Gabriel fans or something? Too bad it's sold out. Thought you could just wiggle right out of that trap, didn't you? Well, wiggle as much as you want. You're not going anywhere. Axel, listen up. Any chance you've seen a creepy-looking beardy guy anywhere? No. Petra told me what happened. I'm keeping an eye out for him. Okay, so I got a little distracted. It's just this machine presses all my buttons. Unnecessarily complicated, mean to birds for no reason. It's just, when something like this calls, you gotta answer. But I swear, as soon as the demonstration is over... We really need your help, Axel. If we don't find this guy soon, we might never find him. I was looking, I just got distracted. Alright, alright, I'll look. After I watch one more chicken get owned. Ha! Huh. I see you now, weirdo. Well, if it isn't Team Trash Bag, how's your stupid pig? I hear intense heat causes brain damage. It does boost the flavor something crazy, though. Aiden, you idiot. Hey, who are you calling an idiot? You. Now move. Hey. You're... What do you think you're doing? Oh, I'm sorry. Get away from me! I said I was sorry. <laughs> Ruben? Where'd you wander off to? Get your pork chops here. Fresh off the bow. Nothing sticks to your ribs quite like a juicy pork chop. What's the big idea? I'm trying to run a business here. That's my pig. You kidnapped my pig. Well, I don't know what you're talking about, Chief. I found this pig wandering alone in the streets. Not the fattest pig I've ever seen. Give him to me, now. You wouldn't be threatening me, would you? What if I am? I'm not interested in arguing with you. I might be amenable to some kind of trade. Not that you look like you've got much of value. <laughs> and I gotta get some kind of return on my investment. Give me back my pig. All right, you little maniac. Fine. Take him. It's yours. Come on, Reuben. I'm sorry, Reuben. I was so busy trying to find that creepy dude, I didn't notice. Remember that thing I had to go do with Petra? Long story short, we met up with this guy. He cheated me and Petra on a deal, and now we're trying to track him down. You in? Oh, I'm in, all right. Any sign of him? I thought I saw him earlier, but it was just a false alarm. Wait! There he is! Looks like he's heading towards the hall. We're gonna have to get past that usher to follow him. Let's go! So... yeah. Hey, what would it take to get us inside tonight? Uh, tickets? <laughs> This might sound crazy, 
but we're actually on an important mission. I hope your mission came with tickets to the show, because, I mean, otherwise... <laughs> chicken! 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 It's gone. You're totally fine. You're a totally cool dude. We have to do something. Like what? This show has been sold out for ages. I could bus right through. I just need a little wind-up room. Any other bright ideas? We need a distraction. A lot of chickens running around might be a distraction. Shoo, shoo! Get out of here! The usher is afraid of chickens. What would you say if I told you I want to break this guy's chicken machine? To create the mother of all distractions. But you have to break that pane of glass. How are you going to reach it? Let's look around. There has to be something we can do. I need to reach that window, but the fence is in the way. And I don't think I can mess up the fence if he's around. Hey, what are you doing? Sorry. Sorry, just your regular everyday chicken enthusiast here. Don't make me call security. I could reach that glass with a slime block. Oh, hey! We meet again! <laughs> One slime block, please. We don't give out slime blocks here, just slime balls. We've got a limited supply today, and we're only giving out two per customer. You could craft your own slime block if you had nine slime balls. Ugh, whatever. A round of slime balls for everyone, please. Wait, this is only eight slime balls. We need one more to make a block. Okay, we need to find another way to get some more slime, and quick. On it. Ruben, I need your guidance. What would you do in a situation like this? I hear you, brother. Hey, uh, Lucas, can you do me a favor? Anything's possible. I need slime balls. I swear I have a really good explanation. Whatever you guys are doing, count me in. Thanks, Lucas. Told you he was useful. Aw, oh, man. This guy isn't actually cool, is he? Remains to be seen. It's crafting time. So, you guys have been building together long? You've got good chemistry. Are you jealous? I'm just saying, I think it's cool you have a team that works so well together. You're totally jealous. How's it going, Jesse? You know how to do this. A slime in every slot, and uh, every slot, a slime. Ta-da! One slime block. Gross. I'll take that. Right... there. It's all you, Jesse. Give me a boost. Whoa, 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 whoa! Ah! My poultry! My precious poultry! Keep your eyes closed, they will peck at your eye! Ah! Oh! Now's our oh. chance! Hey! Where'd he go? There! Through that door! What do we do once we catch him? 
There are a million ways to play this. I wouldn't mind a little payback. He deserves it for crossing Petra. Ready? Ready. He must have gone out another way. What is all this? Looks like it used to be the basement. Weird place to have a hideout. I bet you anything I'll find my wither skull here. And if we find anything else cool to steal along the way, so be it, right? Axel, that's not what we're here to do. I did say we wanted payback. No better payback than thieving from a thief, right? I don't want to stoop to his level. But isn't that the best way to get back at him? I say we take whatever we want. Jesse, come on. What? He stole from us. We should be able to steal from him and not feel bad about it. The faster we find what we're looking for, the faster we can get the heck out of here. Mostly stuff about brewing. Oh, hello. <clears throat> too heavy. And too soft. But super flashy. Yeah, I don't think this guy does much fighting. Hey, you still have that one stone sword, right? Yeah, I had to wave it at this jerkwad butcher earlier. You know, to save Reuben's life. Impressive. You're keeping it. But I thought it was too soft. Too heavy. Eh, it still might come in handy. And it is super flashy. Find anything? I want to steal that and that. I just want to touch that. Ooh, take a look at this. You're not gonna believe me, but I swear I had a dream about this. Okay, Potion, I know this is a big step, but I would be honored if you'd come home with me. Come on, Axel. Make yourself useful and go find that skull. I am. Uh, nope. You're literally doing the exact opposite of what I just asked you to do. There's no way he won't notice his fancy potion is missing. A good thief always covers his tracks. Fixed it. Oh yeah, the perfect crime. What the hell is all this stuff? Soul sand. It was everywhere in the nether. What about that block in the middle? I've never seen one of these before. I wonder if I just take a closer look. Do you feel that? It's almost pulsing. How is it glowing like that? Maybe it's some kind of machine? If it is, it's not like any machine I've ever seen. Don't forget what we're here for. Find that skull. So, good news, weird news. I found the skull, but... What the hell? Why'd I risk my neck for that skull if he's got two of them already? He was in such a hurry to get it, too. There's gotta be something bigger going on here. This has gotta be connected somehow. The chest with the skulls was hidden back here with everything else. That's gotta mean something. But what? I think I know what's going on here. Soul sand, plus three wither skulls. That's the recipe for a wither. But a wither? That's... One of the worst monsters there is. We came down here to find the skull. Well, we found it. Maybe we should just grab it and get out of here while we still can. Uh, guys? Scatter!
Don't you recognize me? Oh, wait. Surprised to see me? No, that's not good. Thought you were rid of me, didn't you? That's better. What was that? Who's there? Olivia, look out! What are you doing here? What did you see? Leave her alone. Yeah, back off, pal. You two. Did you follow me here? You thought you could just screw us over and get away with it, didn't you? We're here to prove you wrong. What are you going to do about it? I have what I want, and you have exactly what you earned. Now get out before I put you out. We know what you're doing down here. Soul sand, and three wither skulls? You're building a wither. Huh, smarter than you look. Hey, nobody talks to my friends like that. Now shut your mouth. Or else. Enough! You've wasted too much of my time already. Where'd he go? If you won't leave of your own volition, <gasps> I'll happily remove you myself. Show our friends the door, will you? <gasps> First time ever here at Endercon, we are very proud to present the one, the only Gabriel. Gabriel! Gabriel, please, please, thank you. Are you with me? Everybody okay? Um, guys? Where's Lucas? I thought he was right behind me. Well, if he's not here, the only place he could be is... He's still down there. Ivor's got an iron golem and all the ingredients to build a wither down there. If he were to unleash it in this crowd of people... We have to act fast. It just so happens that the greatest warrior of all time is in the building. I felt a lot of pressure we should ask Gabriel here. for help. This is the smartest way to help Lucas. He's tough. I just hope he's tough enough to hold out a little bit longer. We need Gabriel to get Lucas back. And to deal with everything else we saw down there. We're doing the right thing, Jesse. I just hope Lucas can hold out against that golem long enough for us to get help. Come on, then. Let's crash this party. With the right training and guidance, anyone, and I mean anyone, can become a hero. You just have to believe it. I want you to look me in the eyes. And I want you to know that I'm looking into... We've you. just got to push through this crowd to get to Gabriel. Start believing. Okay. Keep it orderly, folks. 
Fox. And you, right there in the front row. You know, when uh, well, Elgar and the dragon, um, like, what was her favorite food? Bread. Next question. Dude, manners, come on, come on. Yes, next. What question do you have for the mighty Gabriel? Well? Every person here is in danger. Now hold on just a minute. If this is a joke, it isn't funny. I'm not joking. Somebody's been building a monster in the basement. Hmm. Perhaps we should have this checked out. I have a question for you. Excuse me, sir. You'll have to wait your turn. Just tell me first. Do you really believe anyone can be great? With enough hard work? Yes. Was that where I went wrong? I simply didn't work hard enough? Ivor? Is that really you? How dare you interrupt like this? Wait. This guy's a friend of yours? He's no friend of mine. Finally, a little bit of truth! Why don't you tell them the real story, Gabriel? I see time has made you bitter. And it's made you an even bigger fool. Now these people were promised greatness, and I'm ready to deliver. I'm sorry this is how they had to learn the truth. What's he doing? Nothing built can last forever, Gabriel. I No! Creature, attack! Stay calm. This foul beast is no match for me. Creature, attack! Yeah. <clears throat> what have you done, Gabriel? No, stay away. It's after me, not you. <clears throat> Look at him. The mighty Gabriel! Looks like true greatness is out of his reach. He may not be able to defeat this creature, but I can! Creature! Retreat! <clears throat> creature! Retreat! Retreat, I said! Retreat! Ivor, what are you doing? Oh, uh, no need to be alarmed, my friends. I have an elixir that will destroy this creature. That potion, is that? Uh-oh. Uh, what? Impossible. It should have worked. I took such care. The potion. Axel, you've got to throw the real potion. But... Finders keepers. You thieves, you're ruining everything. Axel, come on. Jesse, throw it. It's protecting itself. Without the command block exposed, the potion is useless. It wasn't supposed to happen like this. Ivor, you coward, come back here. Jesse, help me! Thank you. Ivor was right about one thing. I can't defeat that thing. Not on my own. Everyone's running away. Except for you. Will you help me? I must get to the temple. But what needs to happen next, I can't do alone. Help? How? 
Follow me! 